Mr. Nandan Nilkeni from uh, Bangalore South. Well, who hasn't heard of Nandan Nilkeni's name in the country? And before he moved over to Delhi, who hadn't heard Nandan Nilkeni's name in Bangalore City? I know when time was so precious to him, that is, when he was a very important uh, builder of uh, Infosys, one of the uh, world acclaimed uh, uh, IT institutions about which the whole of India is so proud of. We are proud of Narayan Murthy, we are proud of Azim Premji, we are proud of Nandan Nilkeni. What they have achieved for the, for the, nation, for the nation. I, I, I as foreign minister have been to about 90-98 countries. You know. Wherever Wherever I have gone there, they speak a word of compliment. They convey to me a compliment for the tremendous progress that we have made in the field of uh, IT. And I have always taken Mr. Nandan Nilkeni's name uh, because we worked so, so close uh, during the Bangalore Agenda Task Force. If Bangalore Agenda Task Force was able to show some results to better uh, the city, to improve the lives of the citizens of Bangalore on the health front, on uh, the roads front, on uh, various other reforms in the corporation uh, and in tax, tax matters, you know. Self-assessment. Uh, Self-assessment, you know. He is the father of that scheme, you know, that self-assessment. He has put in such solid work for uh, the development of Bangalore. I was amazed when somebody asked, what has Nandan Nilkeri done for Bangalore? That means he must be blind, you know. <laughs> what Nandan Nilkeri has done in those five years as uh, uh, head of the Bangalore Agenda Task Force is something which history will record in letters of gold. I think that is the contribution Bangalore Agenda Task Force has made. And uh, uh, forget about his contribution, financial contribution. But generating an idea and putting the state government, propel the state government to work in that direction is uh, uh, something uh, which needs to be appreciated.